Welcome back to Supers Live. Sorry about that break, folks. Man, we're having some uh, internet uh, remnants tonight. We've got things rolling now for our first eight-lap heat for the drivers that weren't in the Super 6 for the Turkey Trot. On the pole, ageless veteran Carl Bonsai Becker. Becker out of Lansing, Michigan on the pole. Next door to him, former super modified flagman in the real world, Bobby Hayduck. Hayduck in the 14. Inside row number two, the 25, Bob Gangler. Next door to him, welcome back to Grumpy Jeff Bivens in the NH Auto Spark. U.S. Foods number 07, a kind of a wonky lineup and start. As the outside row goes. Hayda with the jump on the start. Becker and Gang were going at it for second. Bivens right behind him. And we're now moves into second through turn one and two. The ageless Carl Becker drops to third. Hadek with the lead. This big three quarter mile here at Memphis Supers has run here a lot down through the years and mostly all of them for the turkey shoot. Good car count tonight. 14 strong. Thought we would have 15 as Supers all-time champion. The Sandman, Ray Sand Jr. getting back in the swing of things. Couldn't quite get things going, though. Expected to see him back in doing battle with some of the fastest drivers out there. Game we're to the outside now. Out of turn four. Goes around the outside of Hayduck. Takes a lead here halfway through this eight-lap heat race. Hayduck drops to second, Becker in third, Bivens in fourth. The way they finish is the way they will start behind the Super 6. Got another eight-lap heat race coming up after this one, and then the 40-lap feature later on in the broadcast. Don't forget to let us know where you're tuned in from. We'd love to give you a super shout-out during the broadcast. White flags out for the driver of the B&G Racing Photos, number 25. flag flies and we're home for the win in the 25 Hayda comes home second in the number 14 and Carl Becker third in the 42 as uh, looks like Bivens had some problems on the back stretch on that last lap in the Carolina Foods machine as we see tires and all kinds of stuff all over the track he race number one in the bag here at Memphis those drivers will join your Turkey Trot drivers. If you're just joining us, Dave O picking up the win in that. Fans, don't forget to stop by the Supers merchandise store. Pick up some Supers merchandise. We've got plenty of great, uh, great sweatshirts ready for winter. Man, I don't know about you folks, but here in northern Indiana, it has turned cold quickly. And uh, those super sweatshirts are going to feel awful good for the drivers uh, that are in the northern hemisphere. If you're in the southern hemisphere, we've got some great, uh, great T-shirts and tanks as well. So lots of cool stuff for all of you here in uh, the Supers merch store. Check it out online. Uh, link in the stream right now and on the website at uh, Supers merch. Two minutes, 33 seconds of time of the first heat race as we get ready to go with our second heat race. The server rolling forward as soon as we reset it. We'll give you the lineup for heat race number two.
down through the history of this race, there has been uh, at the top of the show. There's, there's a couple of guys that have won it back to back. The first one to do that was Ray Sand Jr. in 2008 and 2009, and then the very next two years, Dave Byron the third won it back to back in 2010 and 11. And then it was quite a long stretch until we saw that again. Kyle Clark won it back-to-back in 2017 and 2018. And then the last two years has been all about Dave O, not only at the turkey shoot, but across the board at all of Supers Racing. Dave has, uh, well, like four championships now since uh, 2018, four seasons. And uh, Brad geezer has been the only one that's been able to break that stranglehold on Dave O's reign at the top. And uh, he'll be looking for his third straight turkey shoot win. And the thing about winning the turkey shoot, everybody wants to win it because the winner goes home with a burger smokehouse turkey. Turkey, Burger smokehouse, simple family tradition since 1927 on the web at smokehouse.com. Here's your starting lineup for heat race number two at Memphis Motorsports Park. The... Uh, had some faster guys in this one. Kind of a good mix here uh, with guys that didn't quite make the Super 6 for the Turkey Trot. On the pole from Wyoming, Michigan, in the number 10 Kenna Auto Supply Machine. It's G-Dub Gary Waldron. Waldron sponsored by Kenna Auto Supply and the Michigan Hill Gang. Outside row number one, this driver hails from Stoneham, Massachusetts. Sponsored by Star Speedway and that blue and green machine, it's Nelson Hot Rodriguez. Rodriguez has been awfully fast here at Memphis. Inside row number two, a bit of a surprise. Uh, thought he was going to have a pretty good time trial run, but crashed in time trials. We'll see what he's got in his heat race here. He hails from Goshen, Indiana. He drives the Smoky Bones Down Home Kitchen, number 08. Keep your eyes on that green car starting third. That's Dandy Danny Ray. And rounding out the field, struggling all night long to keep a connection here. Chisago City, Minnesota, in the Gooby Bear Shoe Racing number 56. It's Dick Schuler. Schuler in the 56 starts scratch on the field. Field rolling down the backstretch here now at Memphis behind the Supers pace car. Waldry going to be bringing it home to green. Here they come, marching out of turn number four, looking for the green flag. Green flag flies. We're racing at Memphis, and look at this, side-by-side side, down in turn one. It's Waldron and Rodriguez. Rodriguez with a nice move to the outside. Looking good. Nelson Rodriguez gets a big run down the back stretch. Rodriguez, oh, man, he is taken off and hiding, but Danny Reyes... A battle on his hands with Tricky Dicky Schuler. He's behind Gary Waldron right now. Schuler looking like he's got things hooked up now in that 56 Gooby beer machine. After having troubles with the connections. Oh, and Schuler bangs the backstretch, goes around in the backstretch. Dick Schuler. Around in the back stretch, keeps it going. No yellow. Nice job. Nice save by Schuler. He keeps going. It looks like Schuler's coming to the pits. Boy, what a save by Dick Schuler out there. We're going back up front with Nelson Rodriguez. Gary Waldron now is uncorked. The Dowker engine in that number 10. Michigan Hill Gang machine. He is reeling in Nelson Rodriguez. Rodriguez. They call him Hot Rod for a reason. Always in the hammer, always on the gas. New Englander growing up at Star Speedway, watching the real Super Modifieds run. They're doing a good job out front right now. Waldron's doing his best to try to reel him in. Danny Ray hanging on in third. About an even split between those three. Two laps to go here in our eight lap heat race. Second one of the night. Oh, and look at this. That Waldron now goes right to the back end of Rodriguez. Is it? Is there trouble? Is Rodriguez running out of fuel? He's notorious for not putting enough fuel in the car. Waldron making a race out of it down to the wire here. Oh, and he gets loose. Last lap. 
Waldron may have just run out of time as, wow, Rodriguez slides high. Now he's back in the hammer. Must have just been trying to gather the car up. Here they come out of turn number four. Man, Rodriguez is slow. He moves to the inside. Waldron gets loose. He's cutting the grass at Memphis. Keeps it going, though. Nice run to the end. Danny Ray shoots in right there at the finish. Pretty good heat race. Nelson, hot Rodriguez with the win. And Nelson Rodriguez. At the end of this one, may have uh, crashed and lost a tire. Looks like he's uh, could be some warp for Rodriguez. But man, what a run there. Maybe that's what was happening there at the end. He was uh, not seeing the track as well as everybody else if he had warp going on. But congratulations to the driver from Stone in Massachusetts. Going to try to get to the line to get his victory lane shot. I don't think he's going to make it. We're going to take a quick break, and we'll be back with the feature lineup for the 40-lap turkey shoot. You won't want to miss this one, folks. It is going to be shaping up to be a great race here through our turkey trot dash and our two heat races. 40-lap feature coming up next. You don't want to miss it. In the meantime, let us know where you're tuned in from so we can give you a super shout out thanks to thd brad for following us this week appreciate the follow we're at 90 followers help us hit 100 before the holidays get your lineup coming up next you're enjoying live super modified sim racing the finest on the supers broadcasting network <laughs> 